Good morning. My name is Renee, and this is Lilac Oaks Farm. Today, we're going to be doing a little bit of this, a little bit of that, and we got a new animal to the farm. So I figured I'd bring you along and share what we got and what we're doing. Let's go farming. Ducks only live for about five to eight years, but some breeds actually go 10 to 20 years. That's a pretty long time. And most ducks are actually kept in captivity for their beauty, their eggs and meat production. There's only one place on this planet where ducks do not live, and that is Antarctica. They are everywhere else, but they're, they're the most widespread waterfowl species in our world. Ducks have an impressive array of eye features. They have three eyelids. They need all those eyelids to help keep the moisture in their eyes. Since they have eyes on the side of their head, they have a 340 degree field of vision. Due to the shape of their eyes, they can see objects near and far simultaneously. Also, each eye moves independently and they store information in the opposite side of their brain. And they also see in color, just like most humans. Why do ducks sleep with one eye open? It is to watch for predators. They have an extensive range for eyesight, way better than us. They can see farther and that way they'll know when a predator is approaching. If you see a flock of ducks and the ducks on the outside have one eye open, they are the guard ducks. They're letting everybody in the inside sleep, very hard sleep with both eyes closed. And they are on the outside watching for those predators, but half their brain is asleep. So the other half with the eye closed is asleep and only one side is awake. Very interesting. Did you know ducks are intelligent and they can be trained? They can be trained to answer to their own name or to come into their paddock to go into their room. If you are new here to Lilac Oaks Farm, we are all about homesteading farming related things. What can you do with what you grow? You can preserve, you can bake, you can cook, you can even grow your own food, whether it's plant or animal. We are all about sharing and showing what you can do with what you grow. So hit that like button and help us grow too. Ducks do not feel the cold in winter like humans do. They actually have an extra layer of fat plus their feet, which we get very cold feet, their feet, they can stand on the snow or ice. They lack nerve endings and blood vessels in their webbed feet, so they do not get as cold as we do. Plus, and also to regulate their heat, that is why you see them a lot of times standing on one foot and the one foot's up. That helps regulate their body temperatures. that North America does have an extinct duck breed. It was called the Labrador, and it went extinct around 1875 off of Long Island, New York.
ducks groom themselves by what we call preening, which is you see them plucking their feathers, ripping stuff out, cleaning themselves like we would do with combing our hair. Ducks preen to remove all the dust, dirt, parasites. Technically, they take baths every time they go swimming, but they need to preen to also keep them waterproof. So on the back where their tail is, there's a little spot in their tail where there's their oil gland, and that is what they're doing. They're touching the oil gland to spread the oil through their feathers, and that is what they're doing when they're taking their head and they're sliding it everywhere. She got some air. <gasps> Yuki, I got a baby egg! Yuki! The duck's bill is extremely sensitive. It is like having a million fingertips all along the bill. So when they put their bill in the dirt, they can tell whether it is plant or protein. They love their protein. So here is our newest animal to the farm or homestead, which is obviously piglets. We have two, both females. One will be bred and the other one is going to be uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. That was because we went in halves with a relative. So we will be getting a boar at some point. This spot that they're in is only temporary. They will be able to go into the garden and root that all up and have that for the winter. An interesting fact that pigs and ducks share, they do not have sweat glands. I did not know that. But that is why pigs also wallow is to help keep them cooler as like ducks go swimming because neither one has sweat glands. And pigs also uh, release heat through respiration. So this will be an interesting adventure. So stay tuned for more. And as always, if you would like to watch another duck video, you can click here and I will see you over there.